Okay, this is Jenny Garcia from EmpowerToChange.com and I'm here um, on my blog on the back end. I'm going to do a review of WP Clicks. This is a plugin. It's not a free plugin. It costs around $97, uh, but it's worth the price. And you're going to see in a minute. Uh, the first time that you install the program, you go here on other settings and here you can add your IP address so that your browsing on your own blog doesn't get into account when she's doing the recording this program this plugin what it does it records what people do once they arrive to the website and we're gonna see it in a minute you can create campaigns for example I, on this blog I don't have a campaign because I don't have a, a, a sales page or a, in this particular blog but on my other blogs I do have a campaign in which I have here the page that has the button the pay buttons or opting box and uh, she's gonna track the click and if the person opted in or purchased the the program and here under watch visitors it's where you get to see all the your data that's going on you know by day i uh, give you the day the time the time spent on on the on your site etc so let me um uh, show you what another thing that is really good is it tells you it tells you how the person arrived to your blog uh, the referrer for example this one is a yahoo search someone search yahoo i do spend some time in yahoo answers and so they probably click from there to to the blog and you can see the the landing page uh, which is the Victoria's Victoria's uh, review of web. Um, I keep saying web videos. We video, okay. And another cool thing is that when people search on Google, you can see the exact keyword that they use to arrive to my blog. And as you can see, they enter create a Facebook banner picture on Pixlr, and I have. A video creating a logo banner in Pixlr. So that's how the person arrived to the blog. And this one here, this one didn't show the, for some reason, the, the keyword, but arrived to the same Wii video review also. And it tells you, you know, uh, the browser they're using, the version of the, of the Windows they're using, etc., etc. Let's see other Googles. I want to show you some of the Googles. Here's another keyword again how to make a logo in Pixel R. And this is very popular. And, and not only that, the person arrived to the page, but you can see how the person click around. All, all the person did and what it, it wants, what page is visited, is shown here. Okay, so let's take a. Uh, I want to show you one of the the videos. Let's take a look at this one, so that you see how this works. It takes a few seconds to load the recording. Okay, now watch that mouse. This one here. That's not my mouse. That's the visitor's mouse movement, and we're gonna see how people sometimes they scan through the articles to see if they like what they're seeing and before the person start watching the video you can see that they scan through the text the titles and that's what this person is doing is scanning through the small paragraphs and the titles to see you know if they're gonna like and then play the video other people go straight to the video and then they read the article. So this is great information and you know to see 
the behavior of how people are browsing your web pages. And as you can see, the person stopped here reading the about Janet Garcia, which is great. I think that's fantastic that they stopped there and, and, and took, you know, the person took the time to read it. <clears throat> so let's take a, let me stop this one and, and look at another one. Okay, let's take a look at this one. Um, let's see this one here. Okay, this one arrived from Facebook, probably a post that I did uh, on one of the groups. And this person came to our blog and arrived to this page here. Let me play it. Okay, apparently this person is watching, viewing the page on maybe an iPad that, that is smaller. And as you can see, this is a share button that I used to have that then it gets in the way when people are having a smaller screen. And so that's why I removed it and, and just put the, the links on the top. But as you can see how this person is scrolling, it tells you a lot. This person is a fast reader. Uh, this person is reading the same way I read. I go through it very quickly. And I can tell what the document is about just by scanning through uh, certain areas of the, of the paragraph and the titles. And that's what this person is, is doing. It, that person is actually reading the document. <clears throat> so let's take a look at what that person is going to do. So it's taking the, their time. And uh, as you can see, now it went back up. And now it started, as you can see here, it started filling out the subscription for our newsletter. So apparently, obviously, that person liked what, you know, what they saw here on, on our site and then opted into our newsletter. So this is great information for you guys. This, this little plugin, it's uh, very, very informative so that you learn what patterns, what people are doing in, on your site. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, um, from where they're coming from, if it's a, a, a Google search or it's refer a direct hit or it's a return customer, you can tell, you can see the keywords, the pages they're coming from, the pages they are visiting, etc., etc. So I'm going to leave the link below so that you can uh, go through it and uh, test it out. And take care. This is Jenna Garcia from EmpowerToChange.com. Have a nice day.